JT Smith here at the front office news. We got a lot of NFL stuff to talk about for you today. Um, the NFL trade line was almost as busy as the NBA trade deadline. And that's normally not the case. Um, first, um, Jimmy Garoppolo was traded to the San Francisco 49ers, my favorite team, for um, a second round pick. So the Patriots pretty much depleted their backup quarterbacks um, just because they value picks. They devalue a lot of people, man. And that's what they do. The only person they keep is Tom Brady. Tom Brady's 40 years old, <clears throat> so it's cool. I'll take Jimmy. I'm up and down on this trade because you trade for him in the middle of the season. This guy is going to be a free agent next next um, at the end of the season. So you're going to either have to long-term sign him or franchise tag him. So he's going to kind of get the Kirk Cousins um, treatment. So we'll see what happens. But for a second-round pick, I guess, if he is the franchise quarterback, that's pretty good. Um, <clears throat> we'll go on to the Seattle Seahawks. They traded and got them a quality left tackle in Dwayne Brown from the Houston Texans. Um, they also The Texans got Jeremy Lane, cornerback, and they also got the fifth-round pick of next year's draft and the second-round pick of 2019. Um, everybody kind of knows why Dwayne Brown was traded. It makes no sense on the Texans' um, part to me because... Everybody knows that Deshaun Watson is a very quality player, and you need linemen. Uh, you know, Bob McNair, because of his comments about the inmates running an asylum, essentially, and Dwayne Brown being a um, grown man just saying, hey, he didn't appreciate that. And I think they traded him, so they pretty much cut their nose off to spite your face to me. All right, um, that's, that's what we end this one at, and we're going to start the next one.